It's been a bit of a tough year for those in the winter sports business, but as News Channel 2's Gaila Retour shows us, the weather, like Viola just said, cooperated with the snow today for the Boonville's annual snow festival. Well, who says we've had a bad winter here in central New York? Not the folks up here in Boonville. They say, hold on. We still got a few more months to go. It's been a bit of a stressful winter to get to this point here in Boonville. So the weather has sort of caused you some stress, huh? A lot of stress. Um, we started building the track in December, and then um, it was really looking great. And uh, we had that 60 degree weather here, and then some rain. But it all worked out as racers have come from all over. Canada, out west, Minnesota, Wisconsin, Vermont, Massachusetts. And fans have come from all over the region to watch these racers go as fast as 106 miles per hour all on a sheet of ice. I, I come from a dirt car background racing, but uh, to watch this, it's competitive and it's they're on the edge. Man, are they on the edge, right? Yes, it's impressive. It's dangerous. Very dangerous. There were a couple of crashes while we were there, as this can be quite a dangerous sport. We spoke to a family member of a rider from DeRider. And uh, do you worry at all? I mean, they're going fast. A little bit, but it's a thrill. We love it. This is called the Boonville Snow Festival 2 because the first snow festival, which started in the 60s, eventually fizzled out and stopped. It was later brought back. It started in the late 1960s and, and then in the 70s, and it was a huge turnout. And if you look into old photos, you'll see that the people were just phenomenal. Mm -hmm. And then the, the volunteers died off. And then in 2006, 2007, the uh, uh, organization was re-erected, and so we just went with Boonville Snow Festival too. Yeah, and then they'd raced across the way in a, in a field for a while, and then they brought it back over here. Man, what a storied history, huh? Oh yeah, yep. Back in the 60s and 70s, you couldn't find a place to stand around here. Why the change? Uh, just people not, not being into it like it used to be. And after three straight years of canceling the event due to weather in 2016, 17, and 18, this is now the second straight year the weather has cooperated. In Boonville, Gary Libertor, News Channel 2. It's Super Bowl Sunday.